Today I'm going to do a little tutorial on the OBS window capture software. It's a great program. I haven't been using it that long, so I don't really have that much knowledge of it, but I'm going to share with you what I know of it. First, you're going to come down here and you're going to click this plus sign. If it's the first time using it, it's going to say scene one, and you're always going to need a scene, so you're going to hit OK. And it's going to come up with the source box and it's going to be blank. So you're going to hit this plus button and you're going to choose window capture which is going to capture just a specific window such as your photos uh, internet search whatnot or you can choose display capture which is going to capture your whole display and you can also add a video capture device which is going to be your webcam or whatever else you use then you just hit ok then you can see me and that comes up there you can have that saved if you use that if not, you can delete it, whatnot. This is a great program to use if you're streaming things or trying to make an online tutorial like this. You can see everything the person's doing. You just record it and blah, blah, blah. Here's my YouTube page. You can see every which way my mouse goes, what I click on, and whatnot. So come back out of there. Come back here. On the side right here, you have Start Streaming. You have to get a special code from YouTube and put it into the settings which I'll show you in a couple seconds where to put it and how to apply it then you can start streaming and making live stuff for YouTube here it's gonna say start recording for you I'm already recording so mine says stop this is how you're gonna start and stop your recordings you're gonna come down to settings it's gonna bring up a box and you're gonna see general stream output audio video hotkeys advanced so you're gonna go down to up to stream, sorry, and this is the stream key I was talking about from YouTube. You're going to have to go into your YouTube settings, it's going to say stream key. That's a key that you should not share with anybody because they can get in and use your stream key and stream onto your channel, which you don't want. Then you're going to, once you get the uh, key, you're going to copy and paste it into here. It's going to be this long. You're going to come down and apply, then you're ready to stream. And the hotkeys is really a good thing too. I have mine set up to start recording for as R and stop recording is S. So when I hit R, I start recording. When I hit S, I stop recording. So I don't have to come all the way back to here and click this button every single time. Other than that, this is really all I know about the program. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit a thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you're not already, hit subscribe. Leave a comment and tell me if you know something else that I could learn about this. And I'll go check it out, and I may make a video on it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you again.